What's up you guys, I'm Jasper and this is JJ Feds. Today, I'm gonna to be informing you guys about a common paint warranty that was offered on many of these white Toyotas, Lexuses, and Scions within this past decade, so stay tuned. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna go a little bit more into detail on what we had to do in order to get this car, our 2016 uh, Toyota Corolla, completely dialed in in terms of getting the warranty and the paint fixed on this car. So here, we're in Mako Ventura. This car has a brand new fresh coat of paint. This is where we're literally just taking delivery of this car right now. I'm gonna name the list for you. So it applies to um, Lexus GX 470, Toyota Avalon, Toyota Camry, Toyota Camry Hybrid, Toyota RAV4, Toyota Corolla, Toyota 4Runner, Scion XB, and Scion IQs. And I'm gonna post all the model years up here as well so you guys get a better understanding for what that is. Toyota broke this warranty up into two separate parts. The primary coverage is effective until February 9th, 2022, with no year or no mileage cap. So that basically means that as long as you get your car into a uh, body shop and get it resprayed and you take documented pictures of the warranty de of the paint defects on your car, you'll be able to get your car resprayed. Obviously, you'll have to pay for it up front, but Toyota will um, will reimburse you for that paint job. The second part of this warranty is uh, go it goes into effect right when the primary coverage expires and that is good for an additional 10 years at least 10 years from when the car was initially registered or licensed so if the car is over 10 years old you're out of luck but if your car is under 10 years old then you have no mileage or year cap on that as well so as long as you do it within the next 10 years you will have an opportunity to get your car resprayed on Toyota. But there are a couple different things that you have to do in order to get that done, which I'm gonna explain right now. It wasn't quite as easy as what a lot of the uh, sources online stated to be. So I'm gonna introduce you guys to my father right here, Jasper Sr., and he's gonna explain what we had to do from start to finish to get this car from being paint defected to being fully resprayed right now. So what do we have to do? Yeah, so uh, it's not as easy as you think. Um, the kind of the information on the internet is obscure. And um, when I called corporate, uh, I had to call like four or five times before um, I got some traction on this. And even at that point, they made me out, fill out a form that was buried very deep on their website, uh, which the first two times failed. I couldn't upload any documents, so on and so forth. Uh, when I finally got uh, my claim submitted, it goes in a submission queue for 10 weeks. And, you know, I took the liberty of just getting it resprayed myself because we didn't want to wait till it got worse and worse. And, you know, I had to pay out of my own pocket. But we got it resprayed here at Mako. It looks fabulous. I would recommend anybody that has chipping on their vehicle to go that route, go get it resprayed document everything in great detail, send the bill to Toyota and go that route. And Toyota has this thing called a, uh, a reimbursement consideration that you can fill out. And basically you submit this form to Toyota. It takes about 45 days for them to review and obviously accept that. But that is a form that you're gonna to have to fill out. I'm gonna post a picture of that form right here to um, thoroughly get Toyota to actually pay for the car, pay for the respray on the car and have this warranty actually fulfilled. Thing because it's hard to sell. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it takes about four, four weeks to five weeks for all the solvent to disappear. And oh, okay. Because you know? if they start putting any tapes anywhere, there is a danger of ripping it. Up. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Would you recommend taking this car through a car wash or anything soon, or just no. let it cure? Let Four it cure. Four to six weeks. Four to six weeks hand, cure. Hand wash. Okay. Hand wash. Okay. Yeah. And after that, you're okay. Okay. Sounds good. Get any information on the internet anywhere? Uh, of course, all these companies. Right? right, and they're suppressing all this, but they can't suppress it from YouTube. And like, and like he was saying before, Toyota did a really good job of suppressing all the information of how you can actually get, yeah. you know, this car resprayed on Toyota. Yeah. And we had to do a bunch of stuff like get a reimbursement request, yeah. and we had to dive really deep into the Toyota archives to find that. We went to the Toyota dealership. They're like, oh, well, we'll respay. Uh, it, yeah, you, so so this panel was affected right here. So we'll send it to our body shop, and then we'll just respray that one panel. You and sign this and, and you sign the this, and we're off the hook. And you know that's not the way we wanted to do it because now the whole car is just going to be messed up in a year. So yeah. that's what that's why we came down to you, and you know got it done right because I knew you would it do a good job. Mm -hmm. All these major corporations, 
they have what is called a PR department. So when a complaint goes in, it goes to them. They say that half the people drop after the PR department. Now mm -hmm. you make 10 phone calls and you know no response. Right. Yeah, yeah. forget it. Yeah. I'd right. Move on with life. And <laughs> those those who persevere, they go to the next step. Who are resilient? Yeah. They they will go now. He goes to the other department. So now it is some other department. Yep. So 20 percent will fall out of that department. By the time you reach the real people, there are only five percent of the people left yeah. who want the. Who was the aggravation? You said, hey, right. I've That's got why I went straight to, to corporate and I just, I didn't give up. Right. Uh-uh. Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you yeah. got to make this right. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Obviously, I mean, you, you went above and beyond to get this car done. I mean, you did the, you did the headlights, you did the bumpers, you did a lot of stuff that you weren't even That's supposed fine. to do. So, it's you're the man. Yeah. Because of you. <laughs> because of That's you, tough. Arun. Thank yeah. you. Thank well, you. I, I, and like, like, I, like I said, you guys, Please be sure to visit my friend Aron. Just make sure you tell him that Jasper sent you. He'll make sure he treats you right. Mako Ventura, just look him up. I know Mako sounds like the lower end brand, but every Mako is run by an individual owner. This guy has been in the business for over 30 years. He does an excellent job and he's got professional people working under him. I mean, the car speaks for itself right here. This isn't like a one stage paint job. This is a full, full blown two stage paint job. Base clear, yeah, base clear with uh, clear coat and everything on it. So like I said, I cannot recommend this organization more. Mako Ventura, Aron, all the way, all the way. All the way. Not only I was able to take you guys with me to get this 2016 Toyota Corolla delivered with a brand new coat of paint, but I also got to show you guys a little bit more in detail about how we got this car from paint defected to resprayed via Toyota's paint warranty recall that affects a lot of these Toyotas, Lexuses, and Scions in the blizzard white paint. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to give me a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.